Okay, let us pray. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, of the Holy Spirit. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good morning, class. Okay, good morning. So, how are you today? How are you today, class? Okay, very good. You're feeling good. Always good. So, how was your long weekend? Wow, I know that you really enjoy your long weekend. So, okay, class, please pick up some piece of paper and plastics on your tables or in your chairs and arrange your chairs, please. Okay, okay, okay. So, I am going to check your attendance first. No one is absent, guys. Class. Class rather. No one is absent? Okay, very good. Perfect attendance. Very good. So, now, who can give me the lesson yesterday? What was our, uh, what was our previous lesson? Okay, yes, Dong? Okay, very good. Our last topic, previous topic rather, was verb. Okay? Verb is an action word okay very good verb is an action word so now before we start i have um um activity or let uh let, me, let us call um energizers or a game so when i say hum you sit down and when i say burger you stand up okay do you understand okay so now let's start hum burger Burger! Ham! Okay, so enough for that. So, now, I am going to show you something. Okay? I am going to show you something and you're, you'll be the one to choose what was, um, what we're um, going to <clears throat> show you. Okay? What do you observe? What do you observe, class? Okay, yes, yes, bye. Okay, very good. You observe that in my right hand, I have a one pen, and in my left hand, I have two pens. So, how about, um, what noun that I used here in front uh, to show you? Okay, yes, Dom? Okay, very good. I am using the singular and plural noun. And, um, anybody or anyone who can differentiate singular and plural noun in their own words. Okay, yes? Okay, very good. So now, um, our topic for today is all about singular and plural noun. So, singular and plural noun. So, singular and plural noun. So, what is noun? Okay, yes, anybody? Yes, no? Okay, very good. Noun is a word that refers to a thing, a person, animal, a place, and idea so there are two types of nouns um the singular and plural noun so singular and plural noun so singular noun it refers to one one person thing place and idea so the plural noun is refers to more than one person place thing or idea so the other term of singular noun is also, um, we can see that the word is singular, it is a without S. And in plural, there is, we need to add S. So, there here is the example of singular and plural noun. So, this one. The singular is ball. Well, in plural is ball. So, in singular, we can see one object. And in the plural, we can see the two thing or objects we can that's why we add s and in singular we without s so do you understand do you have any clarifications questions okay none so far okay very good so now i will group you into three groups so group one you're going to create a two stanza of lyrics song lyrics using a singular and plural noun while in group two you're going to create a two poem stanza using singular and plural noun while in group three i will give you um uh, i will give you a puzzle then you will look the singular and plural noun and 
You must make a sentence out of it. Okay? Okay? Time starts now. At before that, um, I have here a <coughs> the rubrics. <coughs> the ru here is the rubrics in making your output. So, ideas, 30%. Creativity, 30%. Relevance, 20%. Creativity, 20%. And a total of 100%. So, okay, your time starts now. Yes, group one. Okay, that's good. Group two. Okay, that's good also. How about your group three? Okay, so, are you done, class? Okay, very good. So, pause your work now. Okay. Okay, wow, excellent. Your work is very good. And I know that this day, you're really working hard today. Okay. So now, um, I know that you really understand my discussion. So from now, get one for shade of paper and answer the following questions. Get one for shade of paper, class. Write your answer in your paper. Write your answer in your paper. Okay? So, this one, identify the singular and plural noun in a sentence. So, number one to four. And the test two, give at least five sentences using singular and plural noun. So, I will give you five minutes to answer. Okay? Okay? And yes? Okay, yeah. That's right. Are you done, class? Okay, very good. So, now, exchange your paper to your submit. Okay, exchange, guys. Class? Class exchange? Okay, here. Are you done exchanging your paper? Okay, very good. So, let us try to check your work. So, number one. I wrote my test using a pen and a pencil or pencils. What's your answer? Okay, very good. Pencil because <clears throat> she only wrote a one pencil, a one pen. That's why she also used pencil. Number two. I have four book books in my bag. Okay, very good. Books is the answer because, okay, this, she has a four. Num four is plural, right? Okay, so number three, I have two table tables in my bed. Okay, very good. The answer is tables because two also is plural. Number four, my sister has a computer or computers. Okay, very good. Computer because... The sister is only one, that's why the computer is also one. And the word also is has. So, in test two, give at least five sentences using singular and plural noun. So, okay class, um, pass your paper because I will be the one to check your output in test two. Okay? Okay, pass your paper in front class. Okay, so now... I know that you really understand your, um, I you really understand my discussion, but uh, uh, otherwise you get your notebook and write your assignment. Okay? Yes? Yeah, yeah. That book. Okay? Get your notebook and write your assignment. So here is your assignment. So. Your assignment. So your assignment is in your notebook. Write the plural form of the given words below. So, do you understand? Okay, your assignment. So, for example, monkey. So what's the answer? Okay, very good. The answer is monkey. So and and so on. You're going to answer this in your home and. And the next day, we're going to check your work. So, guys, any have um, class? Any have uh, clarifications? Questions? Okay? Okay, none. Okay, so none so far. Okay, so now I know that you have some learnings in my discussion. And let's call it a day class. Okay, let us pray. And then we'll Father and the Son of the Holy Spirit. Amen. In the Father and the Son of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Goodbye, class. Okay, goodbye.